CBS, I guess you worked at CBS Records for a period of time. Yes. And was this in the 70s? Yes. Describe that environment. Well, it was very male. Um, I was one of very few women on the floor. I worked, I worked there twice. I worked in the advertising department first for about two years, and I was making ads for records. And that's where I learned everything I know about office politics. And then I had designed an ad campaign that the head art director at Atlantic Records liked, and uh, he hired me, and I got to do ads and record covers because they were done in the same department. So that's when I just start, started designing album covers. And I did them for a year, and they, they won awards and gotten some design annuals and things like that. So I was hired back by uh, an art director named John Berg to be East Coast art director. What were some of the covers you did when you were at Atlantic? Charles Mingus Changes 1 and 2, wow. which are kind of classics. Uh, John Prine, Common Sense. Wow. Then there were, there were artists like Dee Dee Bridgewater, who, people, you know, who were like lesser known. It's funny because I just went through them uh, because I'm giving some work to a museum in Munich. And there were, I, there were 25. I can't remember them all. There was a guy named, uh, I think his name was uh, maybe Steve Wright. They were, you know, sort of odd, but not big. They weren't big, and they were they were jazz musicians and and quite good. And I did a lot of jazz work at CBS as well. So I, at CBS, I think the the biggest people I did I did a Dylan album, I did a Bruce Springsteen album, and I did a bunch of Billy Joel albums that were probably the most famous artists. And then they were all, you know, there was Boston, which I hate. Um, <laughs> but it's and, but it's uh, uh, but it's an important. <laughs> I mean, it's it lives on in the culture. There was, I had a friend um, named Marty Picar who was a copywriter at CBS, and he says, you know, when you die, your, your tombstone is going to say, design the Boston cover. And I've lived in horror forever. That <laughs> Might that even be, be a it. picture <laughs> on the tombstone of the UFO. <laughs> oh, God. 